Welcome back to TechPress. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to get started with print-on-demand products, but today using Amazon. Whether you are new to e-commerce or looking to expand your product offering, this tutorial will guide you through the steps to successfully do this process in a very easy way. So the very first thing you want to do, of course, to take in mind is the print-on-demand. So understanding what exactly is the print-on-demand element. So first of all, understanding print on demand. Print on demand enables you to create custom design products with no inventory. So the platforms like Printful allows you to design merchandise such as the payroll, accessories, and more, which are then printed and shipped on demand. So that means that we have the option to create as much product as you want and never have to store them. And of course, unless you have any uh, stuff there, any sales, you can just start to make some stuff there. So to get started, first of all, what we're to do is to set up a Amazon seller account. So if you go here into sell.amazon.com, what you want to do is to focus into sign up. Now, you must understand that in order to get started here into the Amazon Sell Hub, you must have an actual account that of course is totally for free, but you might be having an actual monthly estimated payment in order to have access to the Seller Central. So to have access to the Seller Central, what you want to do is to pay $39 for the Seller Plan. So if you have no listing actives, there will be any charge on the next month. But let's say, for example, that after that, to selling into more stores, you have to pay $39 per month. If you don't have any stuff there, then later on, of course, uh, you might be having access to it. Now, in this case, since you don't have any kind of money, you want to reduce some print on the money, you don't want to fill a lot of stuff there, there's another solution for you. This one is called the Amazon Merge On Demand. The Amazon Merge On Demand can be helping you to do exactly the same thing, but you don't have to pay absolutely anything. And of course, you don't have to use Printful, Printify, or other print on the mind application to help you do this process. So, if you wanted to do this process with Amazon Seller Central, you must have an actual account already been created. Then later on, go into your print on demand application account to help you to create products. Inside, for example, Printful. Inside Printful, you can focus here into this element that says stores. Here into stores, I go and scroll all the way down and go for choose the platform. Here into choose the platform, I scroll all the way down and look out for the Amazon Marketplace. And I hit now into connect. Now what I can do, of course, is to choose the Amazon region I wanted to sell on and hit now into authorize in order to continue. Of course, I must be having my Amazon seller account and of course, adding your product to them. Now here, I'm going to show you the other way how you can do this without having to pay absolutely anything. So if I go here into the Amazon Merge on demand, you go here for sign in. If you don't have an account, you don't have to worry about that. You can create one totally for free. Now that you have created your account, what you want to do here is to go here into the actual that says create. Here into create is going to be asking you to import a PNG format, a possible lodged dimension, the RGB color, and less than 25 MB. Now I'm going to choose drag and drop artwork here. So in this case, I'm going to go here for my downloads and look out for a design created by myself. Now it must be really important guys to have the artwork with all of these format elements to have the best uh, resolution possible for your products. Now scroll a little bit down, what you can do is to edit the products which you like to get started in. So for example, I have cases. I have iPhone cases, I have pop sockets, I have zip hoodies, uh, toad bags, and much more. So in this case, I'm going to go for the standard t-shirt. And as you can see, this is the scale of the product. If you wanted to make this a little bit much more higher, what you want to do, of course, is to make, of course, this uh, with more resolution though. So I can, of course, enable all the title pass post. I can, of course, try to select the products I wanted or I do not want it to add. For example, let's say that I don't want to add any kind of t-shirts. So I disabled all my t-shirts, the sweatshirts and poop hoodie though. So I can enable the tote bag, the throw pillows, and iPhone cases, right? So once I have just added the elements I would like to add into my products, let's say that I go here and I go for continue. Now I can scroll a little bit down and check out how it actually looks. If you're okay with your, what you're seeing here, then you can just go and just translate my product information. Here's my product details. So for example, let's go here for cool cast logo. 
uh, the brand, let's say cool cats. Here's the feature bullet number one, the feature bullet number two, and the product description. You can add this, this is totally optional, of course. And lastly, here's the product availability on Amazon. If you wanted to have the search ability, you can just enable this one and hit now into published. And now I'm submitting my design to the follower products. All of this directly here into Amazon. That means that I don't have to pay absolutely anything. And of course, I am not going to be earning a lot of money here, but I might be earning a profit of up to 20% of each sale. So you can try it out with using Amazon Merch On Demand or to do your own Merch On Demand Print On Demand using the Amazon Seller Central. Just make sure that you have paid the monthly estimated quote, which is 39 with 99 USD. So with that being said, guys, we have already to the very end of the video. But don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you want to get started using this kind of elements here into Amazon.com. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Hopefully, with all that, we're going to continue to your brand new section of text press. See you next time.